Hey, what is going on guys? My name is Nort, and in today's Grand Theft Auto 5 video, I'm going to be discussing about a few secret changes which were added into the game of Grand Theft Auto 5 in today's update. So if you guys didn't know already, Rockstar Games added in the Declasse Tornado as the next addition to Benny's original motorworks. A few of us anticipated this ever since Rockstar Games did tease this on the website, and today they finally added it in, and I have to admit, it's an absolute beast. But with this came a few secret changes, and here's probably the most important one I think you guys need to know about in case you think that the game is against you. I've got a few tweets about people discussing the upgrade price fluctuating between player to player. So if you guys have got the Declasse Tornado from Benny's Original Motorworks, then you're going to expect to pay $30,000 to purchase it, and then another $356,000 to upgrade it in Benny's Original Motorworks. However, However, if you are trying to play this sneaky and get the vehicle from the streets and then upgrade it in Benny's original motorworks, you might think to yourself that you will save $30,000, which is a lot of money to save in online. However, this is not the case. If you get this vehicle from the street and try to upgrade it in Benny's original motorworks, it will cost you $375,000. That's pretty much $20,000 more. However, it will still save you money, $10,000 if you are interested in saving that money. If not, then feel free to put purchase it from Benny's mod shop. But if you want to know where you can get a Declasse Tornado, I will list one very specific location. If you go to Grove Street around midday or evening time and just loop around that area, then you should come across a Declasse Tornado pimped up in Grove Street. You can also find them around the area as well. It's a great place to go and check out if you are trying to look for a tornado, but it might take a while for one to spawn in. So if you don't mind spending $10,000 more, go and buy it from Benny's Original Motorworks. But don't think it will save you $30,000 because it won't. And if you have around a million dollars spare, that is exactly how much money you're looking to spend on this vehicle if you are to fully upgrade it. So I thought I may as well make that clear. Anyway, moving on to the next topic, we're going to be discussing about some future information we have and was also teased on Rockstar Games' Newswire. So as many of you guys may know, on Benny's Original Motorworks, if you look on the website, you can see the minivan and the Sabre GT in images on the home page. Now we already know these vehicles are going to be added in and we did have a list of dates on when these vehicles will be added in. It's so far been confirmed that these list of dates is real because we did get the Declasse Tornado today, which was predicted about a month in advance by Yan2295. Now these predictions follow up that the next vehicle, the minivan, is going to be introduced next week, Tuesday the 12th of April, and then we're going to get the Sabre GT on the 19th of April, the week after that. But what we do know is that next week we should also be seeing the adversary mode inch by inch. Now regarding these leaks, Rockstar Games put at the bottom of their newswire that we should expect some more additions to Benny's original motorworks this month, so that pretty much confirms that these dates are extremely likely and we should be seeing another vehicle and possibly an adversary mode being added into GTA Online next week. So make sure you do subscribe to my channel for that so you won't miss out on any content when that does appear. But guys, that's pretty much all I got time for today, I hope you did enjoy this video. I know it's very short and sweet, but it's just a few secrets which were added in today's update, which I think I may as well just share with you guys. Anyway, I hope you did enjoy the video. If you did, be sure to smack that like button, subscribe if you are new here, let me know your thoughts in the comments, but my name is Nort, and I will catch you guys in the next video.